In this video, we will be going over how to make a tag and plant a seed. Planting a seed is one of the first steps in growing a garden. The materials that you will need include a six pack planting container, soil, water from the hose, a pencil, the seed packet you will be planting, and plant tags. To prepare for planting, we will first need to make labels for the plants. The plant tags are used to label each six pack when the plants are sprouting. At Fertile Groundworks, we use planting tags, but at home you can use popsicle sticks or any other supplies. The writing for the labels is done in pencil, because this way we can recycle the tags after we are done using them. To start labeling the tag, place the pointy side of the tag down to be placed into the soil, and the round end of the tag up for labeling. First, write the name of the seed at the top round end of the tag. Below the name, write the accession number of the seed found on the seed packet. Below this, write the date that you are planting the seed. Each label needs to include the name of the seed, the seed accession number, and the date that the seed is planted. Generally, you will need one tag for each six pack of seeds planted. If you are planting less than a six pack of seeds, have a tag for each cell of the particular crop being planted in the six pack. Once you are done making the labels for the seeds, the next step is starting to plant the seed. First, arrange the six packs into a flat. Fill each of the six packs with enough soil to be four-fifths full. Once filled with soil, take the crate out to the watering station and thoroughly wet the soil. You can tell that you have watered the soil enough by making sure water is flowing out the bottom of the crate. Watering the soil before planting the seed is crucial because the plant cannot properly absorb water if it is not watered sufficiently. Also, if you only water the plant after planting the seed, the water can run off taking the seed with it. Once the six packs in the crate are watered, bring the crate over to a dry area to begin planting the seed. Place the seed packet in a dry space on the table or in your hand. It is important that you keep the seeds completely dry because if moist, the seeds won't store well and can germinate in the seed packet before being placed in the soil. Pour a few seeds into your hand and with the moistened tip of a pencil, pick up a seed to plant into the soil. Plant only one seed in the center of each cell. The seed should be planted twice as deep as the seed is big. Be sure to not plant the seed too deep into the soil as it will fail to sprout. Also. Make sure the seed is completely covered by soil and will not be blown away from wind or water and it is not below any small rock which would prevent it from sprouting forth from the soil. It is also important to check the seed packet for more information on how deep to plant the seeds and their germination rate. All packets should have a date in which the plants should be planted by. For new seed packets, seeds are expected to have a 90% germination rate until the date stated on the seed packet. The seed packet also has possible germination times, plant spacing for when you transplant the seedlings, and maturation dates for the fruit of the mature plant. Once the seeds are planted, place the tags into the corresponding six pack rows. Take the crate back to the watering station to water the soil again. This time on a sprinkle setting so that the water does not wash away the seed. Water it enough so that the soil looks visibly wet throughout. Then take the crate with the planted seeds to the hoop house where it will stay until fully sprouted. 